Welcome to today's DDRX. Our anchoring scripture is Hebrews 11.1. 1. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Today I want to encourage you to live your day to day by faith. Live by faith. You know, the just shall live by faith. This statement is so significant and important that it was mentioned four times in the Bible. In Habakkuk 2.4, the just shall live by faith. In Romans 1.17, the just shall live by faith. In Galatians 3.11, the just shall live by faith. In Hebrews 10.38, the Bible also emphasizes it again that the just shall live by faith. You know, faith is an acronym which means forsaking all I trust him. Forsaking all I trust him. You trust God. You know, that's the way to live by faith. You forsake all. You forsake your wisdom, your knowledge, your experience. You know, there, there is room for experience, but when it comes to the work of faith, you look to God. You look to God. In Mark 9, 22 to 23, you know, there is a narrative in the book of, uh, book of Mark, chapter 9, where a man brought his son to the disciples, you know, to cure him of his lunatic. And the Bible says that, the disciples could not cure this guy. And the man brought him to Jesus. And this is what the man said. And oftentimes it had cast him into the fire and into the waters to destroy him. But if thou can do anything, have compassion on us and help us. And Jesus said to him, If you can believe, all things are possible to him that believes. So if you have faith, all things are possible. All what you need to do to live by faith is to be sincere. Don't fake it. And your faith should be placed on Jesus, not on science, not on Moderna, <laughs> producing coronavirus vaccine, or any other uh, biotech. You know, your faith should not be on your wisdom, on your intelligence, on the government. It should not be on your relationship on your friends you know your faith should be on jesus and that's the way the just can live by faith thank you